Okay, so we have a very, very, very pissed off water snake in front of us, as you can see. And very pissed off. Which is pretty much a common trait for water snakes. Everyone knows that they're just wicked aggressive sometimes. But every once in a while you get one of those ones that's like just like a puppy dog sort of. Not in this case though. This is a you know, this is a pretty big one too. You can see you can just kind of see how large she is. She's not happy at all. Of course, water snakes. We're actually about, we're actually right near or, uh, a river right now, or a stream, whatever you want to call it, river stream. Uh, but water snakes are very common around bodies of water like this, and. I actually don't blame this one for being upset with you right now because we've actually had her out for a while. I was taking pictures and stuff, so. But she's actually got a bit of shed skin on her. So it looks like she probably shed recently and then just didn't shed all the way. But very nice snake. And you can see, I just want to point this out, you can see how they flatten out their bodies like this. See how she has her body just really spread out? And you see how her head is also flattened out. And it's got kind of like that triangular shape to it. And that's how people actually can mistake them for venomous snakes. And a lot of people actually mistake them for uh, water moccasins or cotton mounts. Um, which is a real shame because then they end up getting killed or, you know, the person gets injured or something. You know, just bottom line, don't kill snakes, pretty much. Don't kill snakes. You leave them alone, they'll leave you alone. But uh, of course, with cottonmouths, they have the um, kind of like the slit pupil, the cat-like pupil. That's one way of distinguishing them. And water snakes have circular pupils, of course. So that's how you can tell the difference between them. But this far up north, we only have the northern water snakes. No, no water moccasins, cottonmouths, none of that. She's sitting there pretty nicely, you know, she's, I mean, she's struck at me a few times, but, um, she's not trying to run off before like she was when I was trying to take pictures, and, uh, you know, which is nice, you can, you know, kind of just sit there and enjoy her, and even though she has some shed skin left on her still, you can see, you can actually see the, you know, the reddish bands that go around their bodies, and even underneath their belly, they have them. And that's actually where their brightest is underneath the belly. When you flip over these guys and you see their, uh, you know, their bright red belly, belly stripes anyway. But very nice. And I actually like to address this. This is actually the first water snake that's ever bitten me before. <laughs> I've never gotten tagged by a water snake until now. So they kind of ended my streak here with this girl, unfortunately, because you know I was actually I was actually being prideful about that. <laughs> I was taking pride in that. Been bit by racers, garter snakes, but uh, never water snake till now. <laughs> but now she's looking like she wants to take off. There, girl. Now I know, like any second, she's probably gonna turn around and strike at me, but... Yeah, you see how she's flat out her head. She's, she's ready to strike. She's ready to go. <laughs> see? She's ready to go. Just a beautiful snake. Very beautiful snake. It's always nice to see water snakes. Always nice to see them. They are fairly common. You can find them pretty much around, like I said, any kind of body of water. Even marshes sometimes you can find water snakes. Wetlands, ponds, streams. They actually feed on all, all kinds of aquatic animals like, um, you know, like fish, frogs, salamanders. strike Don't bite very cool snake
Very awesome to the water today. Well, we're gonna go ahead and put her back because I'm sure she's well fed up with me by now. So we'll go ahead and put her back and maybe see if we find anything else today. Being good. I'm a little bit surprised. <laughs> I lied. 